It was a chilly Valentine's evening when three college friends, Grace, Michael, and David, decided to attend the local fair that had recently opened up in their town. They were excited to spend the night together, indulging in carnival games, treats, and rides. Little did they know that their fun evening would turn into a nightmare they would never forget. As they strolled through the fair, they stumbled upon a fortune teller's tent. Intrigued, they decided to get their fortunes read. The fortune teller, a mysterious woman with piercing eyes, read each of their fortunes and warned them of an impending danger. She urged them to leave the fair and go back home, but they laughed off her warnings, thinking it was all part of the act. As they continued their night of fun, they noticed a strange man following them. He had a sinister look on his face and seemed to be watching their every move. Feeling uneasy, they decided to split up and meet later. But as the night progressed, they realized that the man was still following them, and now he was joined by a group of creepy-looking individuals. Panic-stricken, they ran for their lives, but it was too late. The group of strangers caught up with them and surrounded them. The strangers were dressed in clown costumes, with painted faces and blood-red lips. They started to chase the three friends around the fair, while sinister laughter echoed through the empty carnival grounds. As they tried to find a way out, they stumbled upon a hidden tent. Thinking it was their only chance for survival, they rushed inside. But it was a trap and they had walked straight into the hands of their captors. The tent was filled with disturbing props, including a makeshift torture chamber. The friends were now trapped, and the clowns began to torture them. They were subjected to unspeakable horrors, and each of them prayed for a miracle. But their prayers were not answered, and they were left to suffer in the hands of their captors. Days later, the friends were reported missing, and a massive search was launched to find them. But they were never found, and the carnival was shut down indefinitely. The townspeople believed that the carnival had been cursed, and no one ever dared to visit it again. The fortune teller's warning had come true, and the three friends had become victims of a Valentine's nightmare that they would never wake up from.